Hello everybody, it's Redbeard Anubis, and welcome back to another episode of LSPDFR. For those that did not see the post announcement on the channel, it pains me to say, but LCPDFR has finally become unplayable. I had so many problems with the uh, last video that I tried to record, it was just not possible. If I find a way to get the game running again, trust me, I'm going to try. But I would not hold hope. We do still have LSPDFR. It is obviously better. I just was kept doing LCPDFR because it was nostalgia for the channel. Because that's how the channel started. It started way back in the day. I think 2017? 18? Something like that? It, with LSPDFR. So anyway, we're out with the BCSO today in LSPDFR. And of course we have this Declassy premiere has the uh, Street Hawk style light bar on it, which is this classic rotor bar. If you want to bring me back, this brings me back. So this is basically like a Chevrolet Caprice back in the day, and my department in my hometown had these grow when I was growing up. Nah, brings me back a little dates myself there. But uh, had these growing up, pretty much, Chevrolet Caprices with the Street Hawk light bars. Then they got the Crown Vicks after. But yeah, no, like I said, brings me back awesome. It is a foggy... It's going to... Yeah, it's a night patrol. It's foggy. It's going to be interesting. We'll see what can happen out there. I also have the second premiere spawned, just so you guys can see it. There are two premieres in the premiere pack. We are using the premiere pack on GTA 5 Dash Mods. Of course, I will have that modification linked in the description below, so y'all can check it out. It's an awesome little retro mod. We're going to be uh, headed out there on patrol today and uh, seeing what we can get into tonight. I'm looking forward to it. So 129, I'll be single 50. Go ahead and show me uh, 23. We are on shift and available for calls. Let's see what can happen out there. We're actually probably going to stretch out, uh, get out of Sandy Shores, and let Sandy Shores PD handle this. This is what they were created for, so they can handle the bum ruckus of Sandy Shores. And we're probably going to head to Grape Sea, you know, places that actually need and require uh, police protection. That isn't a PD. Uh, oh, that was... You're a little driving all over the place there, bud. But we're going to ignore it. We're going to head to our area and uh, see what can happen. I'm looking forward to it. Citizens report a disturbance in Grapeseed. 129 copy. All right. We got a report. Yeah. We got to report a public urination. Uh, probably someone drunk uh, decided to take a piss uh, in the middle of nowhere. And they just ran a stop sign, but we're on a call, so let's avoid traffic. Uh, yeah, and uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, check it out and uh, see what kind of idiot we're dealing with here. So they're in this yellow circle here, probably, I would assume, here at this diner. Um, we're going to pull in. Roger. Ah, we found them. Oh, they're over there. Oh, yeah. No, that's clear as day. Yeah, I'm seeing about three of you right now. E yep. Got a bar just right here. We could probably go in and take a piss, but you're out here. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Hi, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. What you doing? Use your driver, uh, your uh, ID card, please. Yeah, I'm stopping you for uh, public urination, man. You're out here in the middle of nowhere, Mike Thomas. All right, Mike. Uh, quick question for you. Uh, have you been Have you been drinking? You haven't anything to drink, just decided to. What were you doing? Uh, fresh air. Okay, so you like to be outdoors? Understood. And do you have any warrants I need to know about, man? Hell, I know. Okay, fair enough. We're going to go check Mr. Mike Thomas. Do a 26 27 check, a misdemeanor and felony check. He's valid. All right. All right, Mike, just hang out for me, all right? doesn't seem to be intoxicated. I'm not getting any indicators from it. Uh, we're going to go ahead and run him in the system here real quick. Uh, no probation. Stopped two times. Hunting with an expired license and a seatbelt violation. So not a, really a criminal. Just stupid mistakes, honestly. Uh, so we're going to give him a public violation of public urination. And make that a notice to appear. It's not as something he can just uh, not show up to court for. Uh, this, this is like public decency crime. That's all this is. All right, Mike. I am going to be issuing a citation today. It's going to be for public urination. $1,000. Jeez. And uh, 
I'm gonna give you. Uh... Oh wait, Did it... yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is. All right, here we go. Go ahead and sign here. It's not a mission of guilt. Just saying you're gonna show up to court. Course two weeks from today. Yep, man, I am signing you. You can't just be out here peeing. All right. Now people can see us. Somebody called it in. There's a road right there. There's guys over here at this bar drinking, having a good time, and you're out here taking a piss. You could piss inside, or if you would have gone about, mm, I don't know, 20 yards that away behind you, nobody would probably saw you. Yeah, yeah. Well, then we don't do that, okay? All right. Any questions for me? Nope. I don't know. You got to show up to court for it, okay? All right, sir. Have a better night. Cool. I'll hit you up later. All right, he's going to be on his way. 129 will be 23 one citation issued. We're not going to arrest him. We're not going to hem him up for it. Um, public urination is one of those public decency crimes. I didn't see any indicators that uh, needed anything for a check, pat down, all that stuff. Um, I mean, we could in that situation because we are stopping him for a crime. Mike, what are you doing? Just walking across the road. Could get him for jaywalking too, but you know, hey. Attention all units. Code four. No further units required. Thank you, dispatch. Appreciate that. He's going to walk home. Looks like he uh, is going to his home over there. So that'll work. That'll work. And we're going to see what we can get on the next call. Not too bad for a first call uh, today in uh, Blaine County. I'm hoping it continues of this nature and we don't have any uh, extra stupidity. But you know how we, you know how else PDFR go. And, yep, yes, you did. Okay, well, okay. So, normally we turn a blind eye to any dirt bikes um, on the roadway, honestly. However, this guy just didn't stop at stop sign. And, uh, you know, you still need to stop at stop signs, come to a complete stop. We're going to try to catch up to him, see if we can. Here we go. Yeah, we found him. Going to go ahead and uh, pull him over, see what the deal is. Uh, it's not probably not a roadworthy vehicle, but we'll find out. Oh man, those lights look so good. All right, he's pulling over. 129. I'll be uh, 39 on a dirt bike. Going to be East Joshua Road, headed into Sandy. Going to be Sandy Shores jurisdiction now. Uh, one occupant, white male. All right, we're going to go out and talk. We can't run a plate because there isn't one. That's how we're RPing it. Technically, I could run it, quote unquote, and it would be in the system, but. Uh, Anyway, you guys get my point. Hello, sir. I'm Deputy Taylor, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. The reason why I pulled you over today is because you didn't come to a complete stop back there coming on Grapeseed uh, to Joshua. I need to see your driver's license, registration, pay for insurance. Please and thank you. Uh, oh, you have Charles McCarter. You do have insurance and registration for this, do you? All right. Perfect, man. Appreciate it. All right, just go ahead and hang out on the bike, all right? All right, so he actually does have a registered. He just doesn't have the plate display. That, that's that's new. If it didn't come back as registered, I mean, that would be typical for these, but we'll see. So we're going to go ahead and look up uh, Charles McCarter. Uh, valid, stop five times, double parking, animal cruelty, fail to present lighting permit. Oh, for a fire. Okay. Other than that, no arrest record. Had never been to jail on probation. Not drunk, not intoxicated. Doesn't seem to be nervous or anything like that. So, actually, I'm I'm comfortable with be like, dude, stop at intersection so I don't have to talk to you. And that's exactly what I'm gonna tell him. Ah, right, my man. Here's your information back. Hey, listen, I'm gonna cut your break tonight. All right. Just make sure you please just stop at the intersections, okay? I don't wanna freaking stop you. You know that? Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you. I do appreciate your operation. Other than that, man, you're good to go. You have yourself a good night. Wait till I get back to my car before you leave, all right? Thank you. All right. So we're going to watch him. Make sure he doesn't do anything shady and get shot in the back. Because that would suck. We are back in the car. And we're just going to do a nice little Yui here. 129. I'll be 23. Verbal warning issued. And we're going to be back in service and looking for more calls. Let's see what can happen next. We've got a 503 in Grapeseed. 
129, copy. We're in the area. All right, guys, we're going to report of a stolen emergency uh, construction equipment here. We're actually really close, like, just spotted at here at Seaview and uh, Joshua. We said they're headed to the freeway. We're going to go ahead and... What are you guys doing? Get in. Get in it. Oh, there it is. 129. I have eyes on that vehicle, and they are taking off. Gotta love it. Okay, suspect has now left the freeway. Yep. All right. So I'm gonna do something very non-legitly here and go ahead and fix my vehicle because you know, hey. Uh, 129 requesting airship and extra units. We are gonna be doing a UE here. Gonna be uh, headed U.S. Route 13 southbound, southbound, southbound. Headed back towards Joshua. Yep. Uh, what? Uh, what? Uh, what are you doing? Looks like we're gonna maybe be making another turn here. Left turn. All right, we're gonna be heading straight here. Oh, dude, come on. Uh, Union Road, straight Union Road. Gonna be a white pickup truck, possibly a bison carrying a generator on back. Uh, okay, so we got stolen equipment here, which is probably the generator and maybe even the truck. Oh, hey there, doggy. You want it? You want him? You want him? Go, go get him then. If you want him so bad, go get him. 129, are we clear to pit? Okay, we are clear from, uh, Sergeant on duty to perform a pit, so... Ah, oh, there's that, and you failed. All right, we're going to be turning into O'Neill's Ranch. O'Neill's Ranch, come on, bro. All right, 129, requesting additionals out here. We got uh, pursuit on a private property currently, heading through the O'Neill's Ranch. Going off-road, off-road. Coming back on the private dirt road at the O'Neill's Ranch. O'Neill's Ranch, dirt road. All righty. We're going to be coming out. We're going to be on O'Neill Way. O'Neill Way. Going to be continuing here. Cow on the road. Cow on the road. O'Neill Way. All right. Which way are you going to go, bro? All right. We're making a right onto Joe Lane. Right onto Joe Lane. Going to be continuing. All right. We should spike him here soon. Especially if he heads towards Grape Sea, Maine. Up. Uh, we're going to be making a left turn, left turn through the uh, fields off Joe Lane. Going to be on private property again. Going to be uh, continuing. Looks like we're headed back up to Grape Seed, Maine. Turning left towards Main Street, left towards Main Street. We are on Main Street. Going to be passing the LTD up. Making a left on the pro private property once more. Okay. Going to be continuing private property. Unmarked road, dirt road. Gonna make an a right, headed deeper into the farms territory here. Uh, headed towards uh, Grapeseed Airfield. Grapeseed Airfield. Uh, we're on Grapeseed Airfield. Alert the FFA. Make sure we have no incoming uh, aircraft. All right. Or I said FFA. I uh, meant FAA. Wow. Uh, been a long day, guys. But hey, whatever. We're doing this. All right, back on Sea View, headed towards. The, oh. It, yep. Signal eight. Signal eight. Sea View Road. Signal eight. Sea View Road. Requesting spike strips on this vehicle. All right, we're gonna go ahead and spike them. We're gonna go ahead and spike them. Where are the spikes at? I don't see spikes. Alright, we're going to be turning private property again. Man, this dude really likes going off-road. This is the first one I've seen that's like really off-road. Long off-road pursuit and really can't put him with that trailer. GTA physics are not in my favor right now. Well, hey man, at least this premiere is keeping up. <laughs> that's one thing. All right. Uh, yeah. Uh, all right. Back on to uh, Grape Seed Ave. Grape Seed Ave. All right. 
There. Oh, did the trailer come off? Nope. Generator's still attached. I don't know if I, yeah, I don't know if I could pit this. All right, we're gonna request spike strips one more time on this guy. See, it is gonna, it is gonna be, nope, wrong area, my friend. Spike strips missed. All right, we're gonna be continuing through 13, through 13, back onto Union Road. Continuing Union. Uh, spike strips again. Up. Oh. Dang it. Oh, shoot, we predicted them. We're on O'Neill Way, O'Neill Way. There we go, there we go, there we go. Spike strips. Okay, good spikes, good spikes. Ooh, careful there. Pulling spikes. Get out of the car, hands up. Get down on the ground. Moving. Moving. No Do not move. No you understand me? Do not move. 129, 113, and stop O'Neill Way, just outside the O'Neill Farm. All right, my friend. On it. Got your cover fire. Thank you. Appreciate that. Oh, man. Good spikes. Good spikes. Stealing some equipment, and I'm gonna have to repair my vehicle again. I don't know where I hit that at. Oh, when I tried to pit him, that's why. All right, man, you got anything on you that's gonna poke me, stick me, piss me off in any way? All right, I'm gonna patch you down, figure find out that for myself then, seeing as how you don't wanna talk. PCP, and a rusty spoon. Mark. All right, Mark. Carlsberg. Suspended. All right, that's just another charge. This guy, man. Even seen him in an accident, all that jazz. We're going to go ahead and search the vehicle. Couple of grenades. There it is. We're going to ignore that. I'm, I'm irritated with the whole grenade stuff. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and check the truck. It's probably going to come back stolen, but we're going to check it anyway. Target vehicle license plate. No registration, Fork no Edward, insurance. Edward, no. So this is a definitely a construction a work truck. Not even registered. Which you're allowed to do. Why it has a plate on it? No idea. Uh, we're going to go here. And that's the trailer. Target vehicle license plate. 20. Los Santos County Adam, is the owner of this generator. Target is 10-4. Wow. Okay. All right. So, looking at the notes, it says stolen construction equipment. I'm not sure if he just took his work truck for a ride, and that's his work truck, because it's not coming back as stolen. So what I'm thinking here is actually the generator is the county's property. So therefore, he stole property and not the truck, but we're going to still ding him on the truck. All right, so Mr. Carlsberg, you're going to be getting driving while license suspended, evading arrest, leaving the scene of an accident, reckless driving, property, uh, other possession. Oh, yeah, let's do PCP first before I forget it. Uh, drug paraphernalia. PCP, other possession, possession of stolen government property because it belongs to the county of Los Santos. And that's all we're going to really hit him with. We're just going to do that. I could write him for all the other stuff on all the vehicle, but I'm, I'm good on that. I'm just done with the guy. All right. You know what? Uh, yeah, you can go to jail. Assistance required in Grapeseed. Take care, Mark. All right. Whoa, that was weird. Uh, flatbed. Flatty, flatty bed. Flatbed. Assistance required in uh, grape seed. Random deputy lady out there in the middle of the roadway. And Casey's Highway clearance is already in route. Beautiful. Go ahead and take that. All right, they got the truck loaded up, and of course we're gonna call out a flatbed for this as well. Call out a flatbed. Flatbed assistance required in grape seed. 
All right, we'll get the trailer returned back to the county and see what the deal is. I'm happy. I'm happy that we didn't really have to destroy it or do anything crazy. We could pit them and then... Looks like the trailer might be okay, actually. And that's an expensive piece of equipment if it's a generator. So, yeah. Good on that. Alright, we're going to get our car repaired real quick. And head back out on patrol. Uh, take one or two more calls out here in Grapeseed and see what can happen. We have citizens reporting a civilian in need of assistance in uh, Grapeseed. 129 copy, we'll be responding. Alright. Don't know how well this will be censored, so FYI for all you youngins watching. Uh, we got a possible rape attempt. It's a very serious call. We're going to respond there as quick as we can. Disoriented victim. Uh, found him. 129, I believe I located the victim. We're going to be uh, North Calafia. Oh, uh, yeah. Mm hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Alright. Um, let's see if this works. Okay. Um, oh! No, 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 no. Stop turning. Alright. That'll work for now. Good day, ma'am. Are you alright? Uh, man just pulled me in his car and attempted to rape me. Okay. Do you have any information on him? Black exemplar license plate started with 37W. Okay. Okay, I will try to find him. Are you injured? Just want to go home. Can you call a cab? Alright, ma'am. I would really appreciate it, and I would feel better if you went to the hospital, so I'm going to call you out on an ambulance, okay? They're going to check you out, then once everything checks out at the hospital, and, you know, we're going to go ahead and uh, have you talk to medical staff and everything, and then uh, once they're done with their examination and all that stuff, you can go home, okay? All right, we'll make sure we put a rush on you. Don't want to inconvenience anymore, but I know you just want to go home, probably take a shower, but we want to make sure we get that uh, evidence if there is any. Okay, I know you said he attempted, but again. All right, and I'm just gonna walk this way. I actually tried to look away myself. Okay. Ah, dang it. Can you figure it out so I can stop looking? Okay, I don't know what they're doing. What are you guys doing? And what is it? It's scripted in the call, so the, the ambulance is crap. Hey! Stop! Oh my word. Of course, this is going to be a thing. Uh. Hey. Hey! Shoot! Get out of the car! <laughs> Help the lady. She's right there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, this is a thing. Uh, this is what happens when I uh, just don't give her an ambulance. I want my hat back. Go through EUP real quick. Oh my word, you guys suck. Okay, that is... Yeah, that's Blaine County. Okay, cool. Got my hat back. You stop and just go help the lady, dang it. This is why I prefer other EMS stuff. Because you guys suck. Oh my word. Knocked off my glasses too, but I really don't need them in this uh, fog. This is going to be a thing. This is going to legitimately going to be a thing. And I hate to say it, but this is going to be a thing. Hey. Yes, she's right there. She's right there. All right. Lord have mercy. All right. Perfect. All right. Three, seven, William, William, Young, five, three, four. All right, 129 copy. We're going to be that way, Code 3. All right, we have the possible perpetrator uh, vehicle. Uh, let's go ahead and try to catch up with them and initiate a traffic stop. We are going to go code until we get to the area, of course. Uh, we want to get this guy trying to rape ladies. Not a good thing, man. Not a good thing at all. All right, we're in the area. We're going to downgrade here. 
Let's see if we can find him. Uh, oh, I see him. Yeah, 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 I see him, I see him, I see him. I think he's coming down right here. Uh, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Is this our guy? Okay. Crouching on a double L, kick on lights. Yep, okay. He's driving quickly. He's heading towards Main Street. Let's catch up. There he is. Gotcha. I got you. It's the one right in front of us, I'm pretty sure. Yep, this would be it. Target vehicle license plate. Zero two Union Nora Union three two four. Target is ten four. One twenty nine, I'll be thirty nine with that vehicle. Stand by. All right, it's gonna be three seven William William Young five three four. Three seven William William Young five three four. Target is ten four. One twenty nine, semi additional. Assistance required in uh, grape seed. All right, we're getting a uh, forty two, a backup unit out here, an additional. We copy you on standby. All right, they're coming. We're going to approach when they get here. This guy already attempted to rape someone, so we want him ex extra caution. Ooh, he's got the Fugitive. Nice. Cheval Fugitive. I always did like that car. It's like the new Caprice. Hey, Sergeant. Yep, we got a special one here. I don't have my stripes on. I just realized that. Technically, I'm a corporal, but hey, whatever. What are you going to do? Yep. Hello, sir. I'm uh, Deputy Taylor with the uh, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. I need you to go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, please. Step out of the vehicle. Step out of the vehicle. Alright. Whoa! Gun, 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 gun! We are close four. Suspect neutralized. No further units required. You freaking! I knew it. I knew he was gonna do some jank stuff. 129 requesting EMS. 32. My location. Ambulance. Assistance required. And grapeseed. Uh, you're gonna have to stop right there. Just, just stop. Oh, lordy, have mercy. All right, we're going to go ahead and uh, check the car now. Got Blaine County Fire en route. Katana, crossbow, and a dollar bill covered in powder. Okay, Katana, crossbow, not illegal. Dollar bill covered in powder? Yeah, that's legal. All right, picked up the gun. Going to go ahead and search the body. That dude went ham. Go ahead and see if we can find anything else on him. A handgun, a gag, and a condom. Man, this dude was guilty as all heck. Alexander Gaveria. Gar... Gavardia. Gavardia? Gavardia? Sure. Oh, it's San Andreas Medical Service. Okay. We're helping out Blaine County tonight. All right. Hey, at least we get some EMS here. Better than what we had with that LS fire snafu BS. Come on, let's go. Rapido, rapido. Yep, yep, yep. Let's go, let's go. Let's, let's see if he survives. What is Blaine County doing up there? Gotta love AI. Never fails. Don't those lights look great, though? Seriously. Mm -mm -mm. Love retro vehicles. Especially these lore retro vehicles. They're done really, really well. Oh, it failed. Too so bad. I'm so sad. As you guys know. 
don't have any uh, hard feelings about a rapist. I'll tell you that much. Well, anyway, coroner's coming. And we're going to go ahead and get the vehicle towed as always. Going to go ahead and miss, miss my buddy. Thanks, dude. I got the scene. Appreciate your backup. Ah, uh, I already called a corner. Well, I guess we got a double corner. Possibly a crash, because I'm an idiot. But that, my friends, is going to do it. Do it. Yes. That is going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. And, of course, we shall see you on the next video. Make sure you take care of yourselves. And have a wonderful, wonderful evening.